Today we're gonna to talk about leverage. If you had $200,000, is it better to put that in the stock market at a 10% return? Or does it make sense to take that 200,000 and buy some real estate? We're gonna compare. Let's find out. So let's say you had $200,000 cash. Maybe it's you inherited this money, maybe you saved it, or maybe it's a line of credit that you're using to borrow at two or three percent. Okay, so let's let's pretend you take that two hundred thousand dollars and you go put it in the stock market. You buy some crazy good stocks and you are returning ten percent on your two hundred thousand dollars. If you're returning ten percent on your two hundred thousand dollars, you are getting twenty thousand dollars every year. Okay, so that's a pretty good return on your investment. Um, a 10% ROI. Let's say you now take that $200,000 and you leverage it out and buy a real estate asset worth $1 million. Now, you're gonna rent it out to some tenants and assuming your rent pays all the expenses, your property taxes, your insurance, your mortgage payment, so the rent covers all your expenses and there is a zero cash flow, okay? So your rent covers all your expenses. Now, um, <clears throat> Your annual mortgage pay down, so your tenants are paying down your mortgage, is approximately $20,000. So every year your mortgage is gonna come down. So in year one, your mortgage is at 800,000. At the end of year one, your mortgage would be about 780. Okay, $20,000 equity uh, pay down. Assuming the market appreciates. Well, last year in the GTA, there was about 26%. Let's pretend that's too high. Let's half it to 12. Let's say that's too high, that's not even half, but let's say 12. Let's half the 12 to six. Let's still say that's high and let's go with the 4% appreciation. Assuming your million dollar asset now appreciates at 4%, you're returning another $40,000. So you've got the 20, you've got the 40, that's $60,000. So 60,000 divided by your investment of 200,000 is a 30% return on your investment. So. Stock market, 10%. Housing market, 30%. Yeah, just, just baloney. You remember? You remember this? My baloney has a first name. Boom, 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 boom.